Guess we're doing this one boy style. Uh, listen, uh, I appreciate what you said back there. It's good to have friends when you find out your brother's a rack scabbing liar. No doubt he only wished to protect you. Weren't his call to make. Guy dies, he's got the right to know about it. Take heart, Brock. We all die sometime. Any of us more than once. No, never mind all that. We gotta finish putting the spirit through our paces. Come on. Might have to get creative up ahead. Oh! There's eyeball nests all over. Get your throwing arm in here. The nest. Get the dang nest. Above you. Watch it. Better pick out that nest. It'll be Stop pumpering around and smash that thing before more things come out. Listen, you just made the last mistake of your life. Let's go. the more you take away. Ah, is it time? Because the more removed from events you become, the larger their scope in your memory. No, that's bollocks now that I say it. Never mind. <laughs> Today's all right. Done this before? See? Dirty enough to climb on, cling on, whatever you need. 
It's one of Zito's children. Put it in the trash. Great. You got him. Oh, hello there. Sorry. Didn't mean to scare you or anything. You did not. Right. Uh, you can bring that back to Radicoster whenever you're ready. Ah, that's blocked. Favorite ask of the both of you, and we can call it square. What happened down there in the forge with the lady? That's my story to tell, all right? Agreed. Oh, very well. These ugly birds. Maybe those drill will take it down. Nope. I know you. You're the rope suck. We're about to get clean. Say good morning! Set up shop over yonder. Whoa! 
Thank you, Brock. It is a good spear. Damn straight it is. Can I see how you'll be getting down from up here? Best I find my own way back. Been too auspicious a day to end it working and working. Oh, is that the way down? And I'll get those gates working for you. I only hope Sindri's in one piece by the time Brock's done with him. The ice beneath those two is thin enough under the best of circumstances. Where is everyone? Now a good time. I just want to talk. Dad to dad. Speaking of which, imagine my surprise when Atreus came knocking at my door. <laughs> He's doing well, by the way, and will continue to do so just as long as I return to Asgard sometime soon. Besides, our friend here has a has a whole lot to live for. Arguable. Run along now, but behave yourself. <sighs> New spear. Never much cared for Brock. Can't deny the dwarf's talent. You came to speak. Speak. You don't really want war, do you, Kratos? All that blood on your hands on your son's hands. I want peace as much as you do. Perhaps we can find it together. He's lying. I know. That boy of ours is everything I expected. So clever, kind. You're sure he's yours? A kid. You really ought to be very proud. He is the key to peace in our age, to break free from all this fate and prophecy. My son is not your key. Oh, God, do they not have metaphor in your homeland? Or rather, did they? I'm sorry, that's not fair. I know you're not the god you once were. And now is your chance to prove it. Return my son, or you may meet the god I once was. And what kind of god is that, Kratos? What do you even know of godhood? In your lifetimes, has anyone ever worshipped you? Ever prayed to you? Can you even imagine that kind of love? No! You don't care about mortals. You don't care about anything beyond yourself. Beyond the monster who kills without cause. 
You fear what you can never even hope to understand. Is it any wonder that your boy is in no rush to come back to you? Don't listen to him, brother. He's just trying to get in your head. Superior bastard. The nerve of him showing up here. At least you rattled him as much as he rattled you. One with the powers of Dropnia. Interesting. Well, come on. We can discuss it on the train. I do worry, though, if I'm being frank. We've crafted a weapon to kill a god. One could say you're on the verge of returning to form. Does it scare you, aiding another violent god? I'm scared for you, brother. That spear could start a war. THE war. If that no longer concerns you, then maybe Freya's right. Maybe the Giants had you in mind all along. Bet the alpha! 
Yeah, but... 